Hi guys, welcome to the channel and to the energy update for my friends Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus, so let's find out together what's coming through for you. Energies for you, Six of Pentacles and the King of Cups. Energies for your person, the Fool and the Empress. Between you and your person, we have the Ace of Swords. Meeting energies, Nine of Pentacles, Five of Cups and the Four of Swords. The Oracle cards, Round and Round and Community. So guys, you know this person extremely well. Some of you have shared a romantic connection with this person. The situation didn't exactly pan out, Five of Cups. The two of you almost broke contact, Four of Swords. So let's say that the connection went quiet, you know? The two of you can be single at the moment, Nine of Pentacles. This person can reach out, Ace of Swords, so silence can be broken because they want another chance, they fall. And they can say to you that things can improve big time moving forward, the Empress. You may have more doubts because the Six of Pentacles can describe a woman up and down dynamic that you have experienced along the connection. And so the return of this person round and round can leave you guys a little bit iffy. The King of Cups in this case can describe the fact that you had love for this person, but now your feelings and emotions can be kept under the surface of the water on purpose. Because maybe you are disappointed by this person, you know, if we think about a romantic partner, and maybe you are not exactly convinced of the success that they can see in favor of the connection if we think about a reunion. So let's find out a little bit more before we move forward. The community oracle card can be about the fact that this person somehow, some way is still around you. Same city, same group of friends, you know. That's why it can be easier for them to reach out. The star for the Six of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles being iffy for the King of Cups, the Magician for the Fool, so they are ready to take action, Judgment, give me another chance for the Empress, Two of Cups for the Nine of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles for the Five of Cups, and the Ace of Pentacles for the Four of Swords. Some of you may receive a big apology and also a new offer of commitment. This person can say, I still love you, the Two of Cups, I still want you. The Queen of Pentacles is interesting, guys, because some of you will have to decide if you want to give the green light to this reunion or not. You may have to kind of forgive and forget something if we follow the Five of Cups. The figure is looking at the three cups down below, so the past, something that maybe was not exactly satisfying. The two cups behind the back of the figure are still available because we got the energy. You will have to decide if you want to work things out with this person. So there can be a question for you if we follow the star. Do you think that the connection can be rebuilt in a more balanced way, in a more respectful way in order to find gratification, success and satisfaction together moving forward? The Ace of Swords can break the loop that we see in the Two of Pentacles. The final decision, guys, is going to be yours. Let's find out more. Let's see what should you focus on. Death card. A complete revolution. This person can say to you that things are going to be so different this time. Do you believe that? Do you consider the connection as a chapter closed? If that's the case, this person can reach out, but you can turn down the offer, even if it is a big one. Four of Pentacles, closed off. Better safe than sorry, cutting our losses. Someone unavailable to share the Ace of Pentacles. I am leaning towards you guys in a situation like this one, simply because this person can see success in favor of a reconciliation, but you have a voice about that. Page of Pentacles, due diligence, another token of apology. You can receive it 100%. You have to decide if you want to give this connection a new chance or not. In order to evaluate that, you have to remember 
what you've gone through with this person before. What's the obstacle? Nine of Swords, anxiety. I would say fears. Fears that the Five of Cups can pop up once again, like it did before. If this person took advantage of you and you were on the losing side of the agreement along with the connection, you have to think twice before you jump in the connection like there is no tomorrow, kind of because you believe that this time things will be way better. You have to make sure about that. Page of Wands, teeny tiny bit of passion, this person can try to warm up the temperature of the connection that went cold in the recent past. Some of you may think that this person can be immature. Maybe it is the case. The fool in the obstacle. So this person wants a new chance. It is not said that they can get it. The sun. Happiest card in the deck, guys. We also got the star, so you have to truly evaluate if this connection can represent a plus in your life. Can you amplify your inner happiness, your qualities, your virtues, if you think about the chance to get back together with this person? Yes or no? This is the Ace of Swords feedback, you know? The conversation can happen, guys, because this person can reach out, but you will have to decide if you want to try again. Let's ask for guidance about this situation. Not yet. We are ready now. The temperance. It can be the opportunity to heal the connection. To find a new agreement. To meet each other halfway. If there is still love, guys, the temperance can be manifested, but it seems that a new set of agreements is necessary in order for the connection to truly be successful. Because if it is a matter of the same old song, there can be the same old outcome just around the corner. That's why you have to even ask a lot of questions to this person when they reach out. Because they can have a big plan, guys. Ace of Pentacles, the Empress, the Magician, the Fool, the Two of Cups. Do you share the same vision? This is important. Justice. Right and fair decision that follows a right and fair evaluation. This can be your feedback. The final decision. Do you trust the connection, yes or no? Do you want to try again, yes or no? Knight of Wands. This can be a fear, guys. Maybe it is a factor that played against the connection in the past. Maybe it is one of the reasons that can be behind the Five of Cups type of energy. Missed opportunity, regrets, disappointments, sadness, and so forth. This person can say, I am willing to work more for the connection. Beautiful words. You have to evaluate the actions, the effort. Hierophant energy. This person can talk about that. If you were not married, in particular, this person can talk about a marriage because of the Ace of Pentacles influence at the end of the day. Guys, this person can reach out with big plans in their mind. You have to figure out if you can share these plans, but most of all, I would say you have to figure out if you still feel something for this person if you are still in love with them because this is going to make all the difference if you have fallen out of love for this person because of what happened between the two of you they can try to reach out yes round and round but you may politely decide that the situation is not the one for you anymore even if this person brings to your attention a major apology and a major new offer in order to convince you guys to give them another chance. They can try, but there is 
there is also the free will for you to decide according to what can be the best possible progression for you. And the experiences that you collected along the connection in the past are going to play a huge role in the final decision that you will have to make. So be smart, be wise, and do not settle for a situation that can be small or unfair as the one that you have already left behind. You know, so remember that. Guys, I hope that I made myself clear and this was helpful somehow, some way. If you want to comment, like and subscribe, it will help our channel to grow. So thank you. And until next time, I wish you all the best. Take very good care of you and I will talk to you soon. Bye.